Welcome back to Definitely Not Definitive. I'm Ken. And I'm Bethany. And we're just a couple of heretics in love that love reacting to some more Hammer 40K. Which means it's super happy fun time. <laughs> it is Triple Trailer Tuesday, people! So we got three trailers from Warhammer 40K. We got um, the Kill Team Cinematic, we got Armoring of a Space Marine, and the Horus Heresy. So two of these are, are, are pretty new. Um, the Armoring of a Space Marine and the Horus Heresy. Uh, it's been, you know, a, a Warhammer, I guess, has been coming out with a lot of content. I guess they have, like, their Warhammer uh, TV channel coming out or whatever. And so uh, they've been dropping a lot of trailers. And so we're going to check them out. And, yeah, looking forward to it. And if you want more Warhammer 40K reactions, we got playlists down below in the description of our video. It's not only got trailers, but it's got lore stuff that we've covered because we've been getting into that as well. Let's do it. Okay. By the blade and valor of a few. Mm -hmm. Orcs! Oh! <laughs> no, screw it. Doesn't run away, just yells at the fire. <laughs> I wonder if it was pretty fierce. I can see why he went for that. Yeah. I'm sure it's worked for him with things other than fire. <laughs> I accept these burdens as the Imperium pleads. I accept these burdens knowing no fear. I accept these burdens as an angel of the Emperor.
Sherub slaves. I was about to say, I'm like, you gotta cover your eyes, man. I still wanna know how they pee. <laughs> I can't help it. They don't need to pee. My curiosity is getting the better of me. And I just don't see how it's possible. They have little systems in there. What, like I didn't see any zippers. They don't need a zipper. It's got like, you know, a waist system. I never wanted to unleash my legions. Yeah, those are all super intense. Um, I like the just the, the the pace of the armoring of a space marine, just like taking their time with everything, and just the creepy little cherubs in that one. Mm. Yeah, that one was was intense. I, I, I like I like the setting of that one. I think that one was my favorite out of all out of all of them. That's I, I don't know if that's what I necessarily want to see again, but I really enjoyed it. I just couldn't help but think throughout watching all of those how amazing this could be if it was done as like a horror TV series because there is just so much within this world to explore mm. and to dive into in in a truly terrifying way. Well, when As, we watched Death of Hope, it was like, that was like like a horror film almost. Yeah, oh, very much. Yeah. And it's kind of like right, I, I don't know about like right now this particular minute, but like I would say over the past 
five, maybe 10 years, as a culture here in America, we seem to be very interested in sort of like the post-apocalyptic stuff. I mean, Walking Dead took over and was mm -hmm. such a big thing. There've been a lot of post-apocalyptic type of movies. Um, I don't know, we're fascinated with our imminent demise, I guess. Is <laughs> but it just occurred to me that this is sort of within that sphere and also truly horrifying. So if somebody could find the individual characters and storylines to to build off of and dive into this world, it could mm -hmm. be it could be very impressive. Uh, which one is your favorite out of all of them? I liked the horse heresy for getting into a specific character, mm -hmm. but I think it was the arming of the space marine that just gave me sort of like the most chills, the most kind of like, you know, where like your skin just feels like it's crawling a little bit. Like you get that, yeah, that sort of like discomfort where you just kind of need to shake it off a little. And and I definitely felt that from that one. I mean, the first one was cool because uh, you know it was like uh, some good action and the orcs, yeah. uh, you know, taking them on. Uh, that'd be the the faction I, I really want to check out more as Team Orc, uh, just because they're just the you know they seem like they have the most fun. <laughs> they do seem to enjoy their work, that's for sure. Yeah, exactly. And I just love that the guy was. Like, the fire's coming at him, he just yells at him, ah, through his mask, come get me! I do the flames, I don't care! <laughs> so let's know which one of these you like the best, and um, yeah, some suggestions, for, obviously, for more Warhammer 40k. Thanks for letting us know about these, uh, that when they come out, it's always super helpful. And if you want more Warhammer 40k reactions, we got a playlist down below in the description of this video, and just keep in mind that our reaction for this Triple Trailer Tuesday for Warhammer 40k is definitely not definitive.